This is Eva from Septentrio. In this video, I'll show you how to set the antenna lever arm in the web interface of your Asterix I receiver. First, let me explain how the lever arm is defined and why it's important. The antenna lever arm is the vector from the IMU reference point to the GNSS antenna reference point, or ARP. In this example, I'm showing you the lever arm from the IMU of an Asterix IS to the ARP. The IMU reference point is defined in a hardware manual of your Septentrio GNSS INS receiver. For optimal INS GNSS integration, the effect of the lever arm must be compensated for. Lever arm offsets can occur in three dimensions and are always measured in the vehicle reference frame. In order to obtain the desired position accuracy, the lever arm should be provided with millimeter accuracy. Now let me show you how to do this. Open the web interface of the receiver. Go to GNSS INS, select INS Attitude and scroll down. There's a box named Lever Arm from IMU Reference Point to ARP. And of course, this is what we're currently interested in. Enter the Lever Arm coordinates and click on OK. With this configuration, the GNSS INS solution will be calculated at the IMU reference point. In some cases, you might want the navigator to compute the position of your user-defined point of interest. In this case, you can enter the X, Y and Z offset values from the IMU reference point to the point of interest. If you have any questions, or if you'd like more information, visit our support page on septentrio.com. Thanks for watching.